All right, great day today. We're launching the new version of Meta AI. Hey guys, Meta released updates this week on its artificial intelligence tool for the Llama 3 language model, as well as making Meta AI available in more countries and across all of its apps. According to the company, the tool has become faster and was developed using a larger and more detailed database than the previous version. Our assistant, to which you can ask any question in our apps and glasses, and our goal is to build the world's leading artificial intelligence and make it accessible to everyone. Meta AI is now present in the applications of its ecosystem such as Facebook, WhatsApp, Instagram, Messenger, working as an assistant chatbot that can create content and perform research. Now today we're updating Meta AI with Liama 3, our new next generation AI model that we're making available as open source. I'll dive into Liama 3 shortly, but the gist is that we believe Meta AI is now the smartest AI assistant you can use at no cost. However, Artificial intelligence isn't available in all countries yet, but I'll tell you which countries in a moment. Additionally, its smart glasses, partnered with Ryben, the Ryben Meta, also expanded its update with the ability to see what the user is seeing and describe that view, as well as being able to translate signs, images, and menus in real time. The voice assistant has gotten even smarter, able to answer any question by searching for answers in real time on the internet. It would be a kind of chat GPT right in front of you, a real life Jarvis from Iron Man. Before I continue, comment below if you have ever used chat GPT or any other artificial intelligence, what its name is and what you use it for. Let's chat in the comments. Meta has updated its artificial intelligence system to the Lianma 3 model, as I mentioned, and has taken the opportunity to expand the tool in several international markets. Now, in addition to the United States, the AI is also available in Canada, Australia, Uruguay, Paragana, Jamaica, Malawi, New Zealand, Nigeria, Pakistan, Singapore, South Africa, Uganda, Zambia, and Zimbabwe. Don't worry, I'll tell you how you'll be able to use it if your country isn't on this list. It is important to note that for now, the solution is only available in English. You can access the AI through the search bars and chat windows of the apps. In this case, WhatsApp, Instagram, Facebook, Messenger, using the command at Meta AI. To make Meta AI even smarter, we've also integrated real-time knowledge from Google and Bing directly into the answers. We're also making main store and little Meta AI so much easier to use in our apps. We've embedded it right into the search box, which is up top in WhatsApp, Instagram, Facebook, and Messenger. So anytime you have a question, just ask it right there. In the countries we mentioned, you can also now use the assistant on the meta.ai website. And we've built a new website, Meta.ai, to use it across the web. Now, the target still hasn't set a date to expand into other countries, but it hints that this is just the beginning of global expansion for the product. So, is it a matter of waiting patiently or using a VPN to access it right away? Let me know in the comments if you don't know what a VPN is or how to use one, and I'll help you out. Before we continue, remember to subscribe to the channel and like the video to stay up to date. Your likes and subscriptions help us grow, and when we grow, I can bring you even more interesting videos. Deal? Thanks for your support. Continuing. The update and news from Meta A. The new version of Meta has become faster and now delivers better quality responses, along with bringing unique features for interaction and content creation. We're investing a lot of money to create the best AI and open access to our models responsibly. It's an important part of our strategy. The tech industry has shown time and again that open source leads to better, safer, more protected products, faster innovation, and a healthier market. With the tool now integrated into Meta's platforms, people can ask questions about social media posts. For example, if you find a photo of the Northern Lights in Iceland, you can ask Meta AI what the best time of year is to see this phenomenon as explained by the company in a statement. And in addition to enhancing meta products, these models could potentially help unlock advancements in fields like science, healthcare, and more.
So today we're releasing the first set of our Helio Llama 3 models with 80 billion and 70 billion parameters. Also new is the image generation tool called Imagine, which lets you create artwork in real time as you type. That's awesome. We're also rolling out some exciting new creative features. Meta AI now generates high quality animations as well as images so fast that it creates and updates the visuals in real time as you type. It's pretty cool, and you can try it out right now on WhatsApp or the website. This feature was initially released for WhatsApp and the web experience in the United States, but as I mentioned, you can use a VPN. Launched at the end of September, Meta AI is Mark Zuckerberg's company's bet to compete in the generative AI chatbots market like OpenAI's ChatGPT and Google's Gemini. They have the best-in-class performance for their size, and we have many more releases coming soon that will bring multifunctionality and larger context windows. We're also still training a larger dense model with more than 400 billion parameters. And to give you a sense of the Alama 3's performance, this first release of the 8 billion is already almost as powerful as the larger Alama 2 model we've released. Generation of images and GIFs. Creating images from text descriptions is one of the functions of Meta's new generative AI assistant. The company informs that the generation of images is done quickly by the Imagine feature thanks to the Alama 3 model being initially launched on WhatsApp and on the chatbot website in beta version, but which will surely come to the company's other applications. We're also launching several new crafting features. Meta AI now creates high quality animations as well as images so fast that it generates and updates the images in real time as you type. It's pretty awesome and you can check it out right now on WhatsApp or the website. The images produced are sharper and with improved resolution. Plus, the tool can now create animations by turning the photos into GIFs. All of these features will be offered for free on big tech platforms, in addition to being open source, also including Ray-Ban Meta's smart glasses and MetaQuest. Will my glasses receive the image creation feature just with me making a voice description and it generates and sends it to me in the Meta app? Wow, that would be amazing when you're feeling inspired. Who knows, technology does. Leave your ideas and questions in the comments. I'd love to talk about the video's topics. If you enjoyed the video, please like, share and subscribe. You'll see suggestions for upcoming videos here now that make perfect sense for you to watch. See you in the next video. See you soon.